Have you ever felt tired or maybe sleepy for several days after a flight? Do you know it might be a jet lag and there are effects on our body from it? I'm Dr. K, anesthesiologist, and today I will clarify how jet lag works and if you watch till the end, we'll share my tips on how to cope with it. First, let's start with definitions. What is the jet lag? According to Cambridge Dictionary, jet lag is a feeling of tiredness and confusion that people experience after a long trip with time zone differences. Also, jet lag happens when people experience a circadian rhythm malfunction. Huh? Oh, let me clarify this first. In simple words, circadian rhythm is our internal clocks. In the physical, mental, and behavioral changes our body experiences over a 24-hour cycle, light and dark have the biggest influence on circadian rhythm. But food and alcohol intake, stress, physical activity, social environment, and temperature could also affect it. What happens when internal clock breaks? As a result, you may notice tiredness, weakness, desire to sleep during the day, or conversely, not to be able to sleep at night. It may sound pretty complicated, but to deal with jet lag or circadian rhythm failure, here are my top tips. When in the new time zone, spend more time outside. Walk, preferably during daytime hours to help reset your internal rhythms. Use night mode on your devices before going to bed so the bright light of your devices does not confuse your internal clock. Go to bed at the right time and sleep in a comfortable bed. Stay well hydrated. Avoid caffeinated beverages and alcohol. And know this, even experienced pilots cannot always adapt to jet lag. All you can do is listen to your body and rest when necessary. I hope my video was useful. Don't forget to like, leave a comment, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you all for attention.